While the quiet Essex countryside slumbered the world over, we're working on the final development and testing of a completely new range of Ford tractors, the most advanced ever. The new tractor range needed the integrated resources of a new plant. And so, as early as 1961, plans were laid to transfer all Ford tractor production to Basildon. long monorail and now it takes the basic tractors up to the paint shop first for a thorough cleansing and then two coats of a special paint checked for durability in every climatic condition in the world From the paint shop, the tractor moves into the final assembly line. The tractor shape becomes more recognizable, and each part added means more checks to carry out. Checks on efficiency. Checks on quality. the fuel and lubricating oils. Another new Ford is complete, but the tests are not. Iron weights, heavier than any implement the tractor will ever meet, are hung onto the hydraulic linkage to check lifting capacity. And so, after final inspections, the story of one tractor is complete. But the story of Ford Basildon is the story of 300 tractors a day, 75,000 tractors a year, each made with the same meticulous care, each subject to the same stringent series of checks, each sent out with the assurance that it will set new standards of productivity on the farm whether it be 10 miles from Basildon or 10,000. Seventy-five percent of Basildon-made tractors are shipped overseas, earning one percent of Britain's entire export income, justifying Basildon's claim to the title of tractor center of the world. The story is based on the production of the catalogue to promote the completely new models of the 1000 series. Note how they still use the old equivalent names for the models as well as the new series numbers. This was a help to the farmer in the transitional period. So enjoy watching the production of The Catalogue. The lock is standard on the three, four and five thousand tractors. Disengage by depressing the clutch. Another feature common throughout the range, the battery tray swings out to make service and maintenance easier than ever. Now for the major 4,000. Disc brakes. Yes, disc brakes seal to keep out dust and water. Fully live hydraulics with constant drive pumps are fitted to the whole range. Whenever the engine is running, you have power available instantly. Fully independent PTO. Power here for the toughest jobs. 48 horsepower, and it's so easy to hitch and unhitch with a quick detachable guard. Here comes the Super Major. Looks a big, really powerful tractor. The new Super Major is built to do the toughest jobs on the farm. Engine, brand new, Ford designed. Let's illustrate some of the advantages of selector speed on the Major 4000. 
show how it can speed up work, particularly with a front-end loader. Straight into work, raise the hydraulics with a single movement of the quadrant lever, and move the selector lever straight into reverse. Manure spreader will give me another example, if I need it, of the use of independent power takeoff. When you approach the headland, you can disengage without declutching or stopping. You must remember, independent PTO is standard with the dual range eight speed transmission on the major 4000 and super major 5000. 